Okay guys, what is up and welcome back into the channel guys. Today we will be taking a look at USFL Defensive Player of the Year, Chris Odom. Apparently he has three NFL workouts. Um, Edge rusher Chris Odom dominated in the recently completed USFL season. He had 12 and a half sacks. He led the league by three and a half. Um, the Houston Gamblers, he played for the Houston Gamblers. Uh, he also led the league with four blocked kicks, six forced fumbles, and eight tackles for a loss, which, well, he didn't lead the league in tackles for a loss. He ranked third in tackles for a loss with eight. Um, so this is getting Odom a chance to return to the NFL with being given the USFL Defensive Player of the Year honors. His agent, Lewis Bing, announced on Wednesday that he has three workouts scheduled with NFL teams. He did not name the teams, but the workouts are required to be reported by the teams once Odin works out. So basically, once he works out for the teams, which will probably be sometime within the next couple of days, I would think. Uh, this is what, Thursday? So probably by the middle or end of next week he'll probably be done working out with all three of those teams and potentially get more opportunities to work out with more teams and we'll get to figure out who which teams he's working out with then um he's 27 years old he played on the same defensive line as miles garrett for a season at arlington martin high school he attended arkansas state but went undrafted in 2017 he spent time with the Falcons, Packers, Dolphins, and Commanders. He played seven games with Green Bay in 2017 and four with the Commanders in 2019. He spent time with teams coached by Dan Quinn and Mike McCarthy, who both now are at the Cowboys, so they could be potentially one of the teams that he is having a workout with. But, you know, we don't know quite yet. So, um, you know, kind of excited to see what he could bring. You know, there's a lot of teams I feel like that could use him. One of the more notable, the Rams, could use a new, uh, another, ed ru another edge rusher. Um, but I feel like he will get, probably, he'll probably be starting, um, you know, no matter where he goes, he'll probably get starting duties from the start of the season. So, you know, I'm excited to see where he goes. I think he's got a bright future ahead of him. Um, you know, he did really well in the USFL and uh, I'm excited to see where he is able to go but that is all for today's video guys and I will see you guys next time